Welcome back to Kids Fun Science. My name is Ken. Today's experiment is anti-gravity with water and ping pong balls. I have two different experiments. And the first one, we can just kind of see here, it's not really an experiment, that a ping pong ball will, is buoyant and it will just float in a glass of water. But when you take a water bottle, plastic water bottle, cut the bottom off and stick the ping pong ball inside the bottle, when you fill it up with water, it is not going to float. Um, it's going to stay to the bottom because of air pressure. But until you put your hand on the bottom, and then it will cut, float to the top, which is pretty cool. Now for the second experiment, I have an old milk bottle full completely all the way to the rim with water. And I'm going to put a ping pong ball on top of the bottle. And you see the water poured out. And when you go to turn it upside down, the water is not going to come out and the ping pong ball is not going to move until you move the ping pong ball, then the water will come out. Just like that, you can reseal it, but you can see it holds all the water in because of the air pressure, which is a pretty cool experiment. So the science behind this is the ball doesn't float up into the bottle because there is no water beneath it to create the necessary pressure difference for the buoyancy to act effectively. The water flows out around the sides of the ball through the small gaps of the neck, but it doesn't get underneath the ball. Without the water below to extert the higher pressure at the bottom of the surface of the ball, there is no net upward buoyancy force. Instead, the pressure from the water above pushes downward combined with the ball's own weight, keeping the ball in, the, in place in the neck. If the water were able to get underneath the ball, then the buoyancy would kick in. So when I put my hand underneath uh, the neck of the ball, the water's underneath, therefore kicking in the buoyancy and the ball goes to the top, which is pretty cool. I hope you enjoy these experiments. If you do, please remember to click thumbs up and subscribe. And thanks for watching.